play a couple more for you. This one I'm selling. I'm selling this song. It's possibly pain. Um, I do go down to Nashville and uh, write for artists down there. Do you know there's a country music scene down there? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> I couldn't believe it. Just happened to be passing through. <laughs> Opry and a whole lot of things. People with tags hanging from their heads. <laughs> and they're famous. Uh, country music is something I really, really dig, and I'm, I'm, I prefer older uh, generation country music. I'm a big Conway Twitty fan. Okay. Like Conway, I'm a Conway man. But uh, when you're down there and you're writing for people, you have to be pretty eclectic, so you have to be open to a lot of things. And I do love country. I don't necessarily write it, but um, there's a, a man named Toby Keith. He wrote a song called I Love This Bar. You know it? You know, a great song, right? Great song. Well, I figured not everybody's loving that bar. They go to the bar, but they're there for very different reasons. So I figured I'd write a song, the antithesis to Toby Keith's song. I love this bar. I'm just calling it this bar. And uh, maybe you'll get it. Got it. So this is how it is. How selfish me and me and you. <laughs> Seventeen and so chances to be taken to be old man's for
Thanks, everybody.